Marek, welcome to the Stags. You've just taken part in your first training session here at the RH Academy, the club's training ground. How was it? Oh, it was brilliant, yeah. Nice to be finally here. Um, I was really looking forward to be here. Uh, obviously, had a three weeks, three weeks holiday. And yeah, it was unbelievable. All the lets are really good. Uh, the session went great, so I'm really happy to be here. You mentioned your three week break there after you uh, signed for Mansfield mm -hmm. from Luton Town. I understand you went back to Prague. Yeah, I did, yeah. Uh, obviously, haven't been home for, for one year, so went back, um, see the family, um, see all my mates. And yeah, it was, it was really short, but I'm really glad to be back here and, you know, obviously see, see the gaffer, see all the staff and see the lights. Um, and everyone has been brilliant, so I'm really glad to be here now. Back to here at your new club. What are your first impressions? Absolutely brilliant. Uh, the place itself, the football club, the structure of the football club. Obviously, I went to uh, see the gaffer first, uh, come here. He showed me around. He said what he wants to achieve, uh, where this football club is supposed to be, where this football club belongs. And uh, that was really key part for me to, to join this football club. It's a absolutely outstanding training ground. Um, this place is, is magnificent. The stadium is really lovely. Obviously, I played there a few times myself. Uh, it's a great setup. Uh, this is not a League Two football club. This is League One Championship football club. Obviously, I know that you know last season wasn't great, but the two previous seasons, both of them, you've been pl in playoffs, and this football club deserves something more, not to be in League Two. So, uh, I think the all the players what Gaffa brought in so far and the squad we what already he had, I think is a great group of lads. Um, so we've got six weeks to prepare um, for the best and uh, I'm really looking forward to it and I'm, I'm up for the challenge. When I got approached from Mansfield, because Mansfield wanted me in January to come on loan, but unfortunately one of our keepers got injured so I couldn't go. But I wanted to come here in January to play. Uh, now I'm glad I'm sitting here now after six months. I met the gaffer, I met all the staff, I met the boys. Everyone is absolutely brilliant. The goalie coach, Seamus, Sam, the, the younger kid who is helping out, um, all the three keepers, they're absolutely brilliant. So it's a really nice environment to work in. And when you've got people like this, it makes it very easy. You mentioned about uh, potentially joining back in January. Um, just rewinding the clock further, if I may, what are your memories of playing against Mansfield over the years? The memories are really great. Obviously, when we play here in League Two, that we it was a crazy game. I think we draw to each or save the penalty in the last minute, uh, and I went a bit mad after saving a pen, <laughs> which it made a headline. But um, yeah, that game was crazy. That game was actually up and down, up and down. Uh, we were, I think, losing 2-0, 2-1, and then, then I think it was 2-2 and I save a pen. So, yeah, it was, it's always a great memory. So, I mean, I always, when I come to the Mansfield Football Club, the fans always on top of you. So, it's always a difficult place to play. So, I'm really looking forward to be on the other side now and to play with Mansfield against the other teams. As a goalkeeper, what are your main strengths? For me, it's being Domina at the box, coming for crosses, uh, be a leader, um, don't be scared on your line, come out if I can, come for the cross, make important saves, saves when it needs to be made, last minute, if you have one save, make that save. So this is my, probably, things about myself that I want to be dominant, I want to be strong in my own box, in my area. I want to be loud at the pitch, that people know I'm there, the defenders know I'm there for them. And um, yeah, that's about it. The new season, of course, is set to start behind closed doors. <laughs> what sort of difference will, will that make? Well, obviously I'm from Czech, so I see how it was playing now with no fans and it started playing with the fans now so it's a big difference hopefully it will get there I, I you know I hope and I pray that 
by end of September, the first week in October, we're going to have final events, at least the two and a half thousand of season ticket holders. I would love to see fans at the football. You know, we play for the fans. Yes, you play for yourself, for your teammates. But the most important, when you come there, you play for your club and you play for your fans. So when you don't have the fans there, you have to motivate yourself. We have to motivate each other at the football pitch. And um, yes, it's going to be strange. It's going to be similar to pre-season when we're going to be playing pre-season games behind closed doors at the stadiums. So this is a test for us now. We're going to prepare like that without no fans. So when we come there, the first league game or the first uh, cup game, whatever it is, we, we're not going to be surprised. And, you know, we would obviously love to see the fans there soon as, hopefully by Boris. <laughs> <laughs> needs to hurry up to, to get the green light, but um, yeah, at the minute we just have to prepare and, and, uh, and just be sensible and take it as it is, you know. Everyone is, is at the same boat, not le League 2, League 1, ev everyone in UK, so once we get the green light, then hopefully we can start seeing the fans in the stadium. And finally, you touched upon this earlier, but in a bit more depth, perhaps, have you set specific targets for yourself this season, at this, your new club? My targets, I always put my targets quite high, but I obviously like to play every single game, stay fit. I think that's the most important for me, to stay fit, look after myself, be the best I can every single week, Tuesday, whatever it is, Tuesday, Saturday, be here for the, for the football club. And the targets, obviously, not just for me, I think, it's, it's, it's just for all the football club is to go up. That's, that's the main target for me. This is the reason why I come to this football club. I just don't want to be comfortable and be in a mid-table. I think this football club deserves more. They've been unlucky for the last three years. So hopefully this time, this year, the, the, the players with the Gaffa recruited and the players who have already been here before, last season, is good enough to this season to go, get, get promoted. That's, that's my target. I want not I want, but us, I'm talking for us, to we need to get promoted. Delighted to meet you. I'm absolutely delighted.